It's really nice, you know, I'm glad to be back and um, it's nice weather and I have a partner for this week, Turkish Airlines. I was flying with them, great flight and, you know, I'm, I'm happy to be back. So it's not your visit here in Dubai. What do you like most about this city? You know, I mean, most of the time I do spend my time in a winter weather where it's cold and, you know, weather is really awesome. I love, I love golf course, you know, and I just love, you know, all the things around like shopping malls, food, the people are really nice, so it's just all together. Yeah, wonderful. So, uh, it will be a, a tough week this week, mm -hmm. uh, what are your expectations for the competition? You know, I've been playing well for the last two months, three months, and, you know, my injury has been gone, so I'm prepared for this week. It's one of the main weeks, and, you know, I mean, I've been playing good all over this golf course, so expectations are very high. Yeah, you did good result in 2008, yeah. so looking forward to do your best this time. Obviously, definitely. Yes, wonderful. Maria, uh, you turned professional in 2006, and so far you're doing, you're doing very good on the courses. What's the secret behind this? You know, I mean, I'm a really hard worker, and I love practicing, and you know, obviously golf is my, is my love, it's what inside me, and you know, I just think you got it, you know, within yourself, and with your soul, with your love, so that's the main thing. What? Uh, tell us, um, you said you're a hard worker, mm -hmm. tell us about your day usually, how many hours you practice, uh, how, how does your day go? Well, pretty much, you know, I wake up at 7, 6.30, go to the gym, uh, work out a few hours and go on the golf course, practice, play, depends, you know, what I plan for the day and then go back to the gym. So it's pretty tough and I do like six days a week and I take Sunday off. Ah, wonderful. So tell us about your relation with your family, especially because you spend most of your time outside Germany, mm -hmm. traveling from one city to another. Well, actually, yeah, I'm moving to Germany. I love the people. I love Munich where I live and, you know, I love the place. But it's quite hard for me because my family lives back in Moscow and, you know, I don't see them a lot. So obviously, hopefully this Christmas or New Year, I'll be back. But, you know, it's one of, one of the parts where you've got to be, um, you know, like confident and got to stick to it. You've got to travel a lot and it doesn't bother me at all. Uh, you were uh, you were nominated the best Russian player for 2004-2006. Mm -hmm. uh, tell us the golf in uh, Russia. How is it going? You know, it's very hard to say. We have such a little season, and you know, it's snowing by now. And where you see it right now over here, it's like really good weather. And um, I mean, it's not moving anywhere. It, it's moving a little bit, but. Hopefully, you know, me being a latest European tour or playing LPJ next year or the year after, you know, will kind of push Russian golf a little bit forward. Yeah, since the golf is moving slowly in Russia, mm -hmm. why did you decide to be a golf player? You know, it just happened. We were uh, going through a golf club with my dad uh, 12 years ago and we just stopped for a cup of coffee and, you know, it just happened. I was just looking at the game and I just said, I want to play it. You know, we came back next day for a lesson. Ah, that's good. Well, uh, the golf here in the Middle East and in the Arab world, mm -hmm. it's the only tour that happens in this part of the world, which is in Dubai. So what do you think of this? Um, you know, I mean, Dubai and I, I guess actually in Abu Dhabi as well. Um, I mean, it's a big golf destination and it's one of the most favorite, you know, golf destinations for golfers. Just because of the weather, because of the uh, golf conditions, because of the golf course. I think it's really, really good because, you know, after us, there are guys playing over here for Dubai Classic, so I, I guess it's just, you know, it's just one of the best golf destinations ever. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, since you started playing golf, uh, have you ever had any role model you would like to be like this player? You know, I w I've been asked that question a lot and I always wanted to be myself. You know, it's hard to say. I want to be like Annika or I want to be like someone else, you know. I want to be myself and, you know, I have my own um, style, so it's, it's just me. Uh-huh. Uh, and um, you think, uh, are you putting certain target you want to reach during, let's say, five years, six years, mm -hmm. seven years? I would, I would like to be this rank or I would like to, to achieve this title. Oh, definitely, you know. First of all, I want to uh, win on LAT and get as high as the ranking as I can and then play obviously LPJ and win down there. Uh -huh. 
usually the the, the athletes uh, while when they started the the sports mm -hmm. uh, they go away from studies and from university did you continue your studies no i just literally graduated last year uh from sports and medicine university or back in moscow it was very hard to you know to do the same things at once i was playing golf on tour and i was coming back to russia and doing my studying but I wanted to go further down, but my schedule was so tough with my goal, so I decided not, not to do any studying by now. <laughs> okay, uh, so uh, as you said, that the, the vacation for the golf player is not too long. So what would you like to do in your vacations, in your free time? You know, I, I didn't have vacations for the last uh, five years, so we actually uh, thinking about going to somewhere really nice and, you know, just relax, have more sleep, you know, just... Um, you know, go have nice food, that's I think all sportsmen want dreaming of. Okay, so after Dubai, where are you going? Where is your, what is your next destination? Uh, I guess it's either Spain, playing as an event in Spain, and then um, I will probably take two weeks off. But I haven't thought about vacations yet. <laughs> where are you staying here in Dubai, in which hotel? Um, Barsha Center. Uh -huh. So it's a little hotel, but you know, it's just one of these places because I spent so little time in a hotel and you know, most of the time you're playing golf, you're doing your own stuff, you're going to the gym, so you pretty much don't spend time in a hotel. You're planning to have any other activities other than the golf here in Dubai? Yeah, obviously I'll do a little bit of gym, I'll do a little bit of riding to keep myself fit. You know, the weather is going to be very, very hot, so you gotta, you know, you gotta get back uh, oxygen back in your body. Okay. What do you think of the Arabic food here in Dubai? Or you didn't taste it yet? No, you know, uh, I had a really, really nice dinner over in Abu Dhabi last year, and it was, I mean, you guys have a really, really nice food, and I love it. Thank you. <laughs> so we wish you a good stay here Thank in Dubai, you. and the best luck for the coming nice. weeks. Thank you. Thank you.